Greetings everyone, my name is SRG21 and welcome to Let's Play Toy Soldiers. Toy Soldiers is a tower defense game set in World War 1 and we are going to be killing stuff. Preferably little toy soldiers. I'll show you in a minute but all the toys and all like your defenses in this game are actually little toy soldiers. It's kind of cool. You can also take control of turrets and stuff. So you're not just sitting back and waiting for the enemies to come towards you. It's kind of cool. On my machine gun now. Blasting away. Ha <laughs> ha So the more people you kill, the more points you get. And obviously, if you kill groups of people, you get multipliers. It means more points. And the whole point of the game is to stop. The enemy toy soldiers getting into your base, which is a giant toolbox, which I'll show you in a bit. Everything comes in waves. Oh, look, one left. See? And if you take, well, let your turrets do their own work and you don't take control of it. Oh, here's the enemy base. You can't actually send your toy soldiers over there. You only get the first wave. And they don't really do much. They just die. It's kind of weird. Here comes second wave. Oh shit. Oh golly, there's a lot of them. Yeah, there's only nine waves in this though, so I should be okay. This is set on normal mode. There's normal, easy of course, expert, and I think general mode or something. I do know the last mode is your turrets can only be controlled by you, they don't like fire automatically. Okay, you won't need anything else. I was going to do this from scratch, but that wouldn't have been fun. If you do the game from scratch, you won't be able to upgrade any of your turrets. You won't be able to do any of that. But for the sake of this let's play, I just want to make it a bit faster. And more easier on my part. Oh well. See, I'm just showing you here, you can take control of your turrets. I miss completely. But this is the howitzer, it's your artillery, you can guide the um shell as you fire it I guess. Blowing shit up. Boom. Ha. <laughs> it's a cute little game. I think you can only get it on Xbox Live and PC though. Not sure about PS3. You might do, you might. See that I am just upgrading this here. Ba -ba -da -ba -bum. Uh, obviously you get money for killing people which is strange because it's in dollars yet most of the little toy figures you see here are either French or British so don't know why I'm using dollars for those who don't know the Americans only came into the war late in the game and by then it was pretty much all over Though what's kind of funny about that is the Americans brought over pump action shotguns which weren't really widely available in Europe. And the Germans petitioned for these like little, ooh six piece, pump action shotguns to be banned from warfare because they thought it was too deadly. Yet the Germans were using like gas and stuff to try and kill the French and British troops and slaughtering each other. It's just, I thought it was quite amusing. That they're using toxic gas that like ruins people's lives it's like oh Americans got their pump action shotguns yeah so unsporting they come over here and they bring their shotguns shooting us shooting us I tell you ha I'm upgrading the howitzer to the last stage which is mother here you wouldn't like this mother in you ha look at the fucking size of it The more you upgrade things, the more powerful they get, but the longer it takes for them to reload or overshot that. You can blow up some of the scenery as well. Don't know if you can see in the background, but we are actually sort of on a table of sorts. It's like the whole background is basically a room, which is kind of cool. This picture of like when you go to bed, like was it Toy Story and all your like little toys come to life 
and kill each other. Because hey, that's what toys do. <laughs> Bam. You can also make waves come faster, but for this, I actually want to get rid of these mortars. So I can get some extra points. At the end, you're scored by point system. And there's always little Easter eggs and stuff you have to do on each mission to unlock. I think you had to unlock. You unlock this. Um, in the main menu, you have this little collectible box and doing stuff in game. What am I doing? Um, yes, yeah, Houser. Doing stuff in game obviously gets you the collectibles. You can only place turrets on these little pillbox type areas. And these guys are stormtroopers. Not the do 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 stormtroopers from Star Wars. They just have machine guns and are a bitch to kill. Except if you have mother. <laughs> yes. Comical name to your cannon. See if you notice the difference between these guys and your standard troops is that the machine gun doesn't take them down so quickly. Obviously you have different levels of troops and that's the second level, then you have cavalry after that, which is if you can see at the top it shows you what's coming next. Then you have armoured personnel carriers and you have tanks. You have just about everything. And should I put another one up here? I oh, don't have enough money. Ha! Ah, bring up mother. And boom! <laughs> you can also kill readying troops, which makes it easy or easier. They replenish until they go over the top, or you sound for them to go. But if you take out a good bunch of them, then launch the attack. You can obviously weather the storm as it were. And those guys are getting pretty close. Ah, oh, only got two people there. Um, this is not good. I'll upgrade that. Um, let's place a gas thing, just in case. This is a chemical turret. It's kind of like a flamethrower. At first, it's a gas turret, then it upgrades to a flamethrower. Ah, oh, didn't need it. Just showing it off a bit there. This is the auto cannon. It's the second upgrade for the machine gun. And see, look. British Tommies. God save the gracious queen. Placing the mortar here. There's only a few turrets. It's not like if you play those flash tower defense games. It's like gives you 500 different turrets. It's like no. You have a machine gun. You have a mortar. You have oh shit. I'm personnel carrier. Fuck. You have a howitzer, you have a chemical one, and you have barbed wire, which is not really a turret, it just slows the enemy down. Kinda cool. But it is no match for mother. Oh. Boom! And that is it. The end of this ver episode, I should say, of the Let's Play. I hope you enjoy it. Please click the like button and favourite or subscribe. And I shall see you next episode.